Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I went out late tonight, even though I have finals tomorrow, to uh, when I passed by the dumpster earlier, I had seen a couple things in the Pier 1 dumpster. And so I wanted to make sure that the store was closed before I went back. Um, so let's get into this haul. So the first thing I have is this picture frame. And it is missing a couple beads, but I can always replace them with, you know, beads from Michael's or Hobby Lobby or something like that. But it has a little kickstand on the back. Um, it was originally $12.95 and they have it for $5.98. So then we have a gold one and all it is is missing this one right here. Um, but other than that, I mean, it doesn't have the back on it, but I could totally make that into something else. And then I have these cute clocks. Look at these clocks. All dazzling and stuff. So it is missing some beads on this also. And I will just replace them. But as you can see, the clock is moving because I put batteries in them and they actually work. And so here's the second one. And like I said, it's missing again some of the beads. And the prices on those, let me see. The price on them are $12.95. And then they went down to $10 and then they went down to free. Okay, so then we have this vintage linen candle, which, yeah, it, it smells vintage. <laughs> um, kind of smells like great grandma's house or something. It definitely has a, a vintage smell to it, but some people like that. Um, let me see. That one is $11.95 for this candle. And so then I have this, um, which I would think would be a mosquito because I live in Texas and we have some big suckers just like this. So I would say it's mosquito. Maybe it's a hummingbird or something. What do you think, guys? What do you think this is? Um, make a comment let me know it does look like it have a needle nose or maybe it's a beak but it is really cute so anyway so on to um the dollar general so the dollar general today was penny day for all y'all couponers out there and um fugal people you would know that penny days mean if they don't take the stuff off the shelf um like holiday things or whatever like that some clothes and stuff they mark it down it marks down to a penny and they usually supposed to take it off the shelves before that Tuesday because Tuesdays is penny days and anybody that knows um, they actually have uh, sites and everything on Facebook that you can get on for penny sales so anyway I didn't get this for a penny I got these for free I was at the Dollar General dumpster and this was actually in a cardboard box turned over by the dumpster and something just told me why don't you just check this little box so anyway when I did this was, was in it so we have these little stress balls which I had never seen these before these are so cute little Easter stress balls so I have one two three four five and six of those stress balls and then I have these cute little jump ropes look at these guys these are so cute so I have a friend that her and her husband have a ministry that goes to Honduras and Haiti in the summertime and they always need in toys for the kids over there because they really don't have anything to play with um, a lot of times is garbage is cans and stuff like that that's not healthy for them to be playing with and so I'm thinking with all these toys and different things that I collect that I'll be able to hand that to her when she gets ready to go on her trip in the summer look at these paddle balls so cute I haven't seen paddle balls since I was little um, anyway so these have little chickadees on there 
and then we have three that have little bunnies on there but I think this would be a cute I mean they the kids would love that they would love having some you know something's really nice um, for them so anyway guys um, that's it for my haul tonight I hope you enjoy what you've seen if you haven't subscribed to my channel hit the subscribe button and if you like what you see, click the like button, and I will see you on the next side.